Alright, hello there, my name is Mantis, and we're playing A Juggler's Tale. Seems to be an indie adventure game. And, uh, looks absolutely beautiful so far. Uh, the game has just been released, has just been released earlier this month. And it's actually a. I saw the trailer and it looks really beautiful. If you're interested in getting your game, I'll be looking, linking the links down in the description box below. It's now available on Steam, Epic, GOG, PlayStation, Xbox, and a Nintendo Switch. Anyway, before we start, let's take a look at the settings first. Okay, earlier on, I have actually. I have not. I have actually. I was supposed to have changed the settings. Okay, we're gonna be changing the settings here. Default. I'm gonna change the. Change the key bindings here just to make it a little bit more intuitive. Yep, there we go. Interaction color will be red. You can actually play it with the controller. Okay, we're, I think we're good to go here. And as for subtitles, I've put it into um, maximum mode, so subtitle size will be a big, bit bigger for us. Anyway, so let's take a sh let's take a start. The moon hangs heavy in the late night sky, yet the Pope's still full. Let's have a look why. The day was long and offered nothing of cheer. How about a story over a mug of beer? Crowd around all who dwell here. I'm Jack. Call me the storyteller. Quiet down and lend me your ear. I know exactly what you want to hear. I'll spin you a yarn, and before I'm through, you'll be as sure as I that every word is true. It's about a brave little girl with hardly a fear who looked for her life like any of these kids here. But wait, who's this stumbling onto the stage? A round of applause for our leading lady. Her name is Abby. She lived in a quaint little village just like... like this one. Trust me, it's not so important where you are from. Even the meekest hick town has stories galore. So that one I'm telling might as well be yours. Okay, seems that I am now able to move. Let's see. Up, oh, yep, there we go. Here I am. I can jump. I can't crouch, but I can jump. Let's experiment a little bit. Can I interact with anything? Let's keep moving. Oh, here we go. Can I go and... I'm just jumping up and down here. A little circus was in town, traveling their route, wooing the locals wherever they were about. And amongst all these passers-by, here's Abby. Would you like to say hi? Should I be able to say hi to this man here? Okay, so I can hold control to move or push objects. Okay, for instead of control, I'll be using J. So here we go. Oh, I can climb on. Just move. Okay. In my case, I'm using J to control uh, in place of control. Just jump on top. There's a bit of a tutorial here. Can I? Okay. Okay, I might have to climb over that wooden fence. So what we'll do is we'll move up here. We'll climb up. Yep, there we go. And here we go. Now we can move a little bit further down. 
Make a hop, skip, jump. Up. Oh, gonna jump. Here we go. Up. Oh, here we go. And here I am juggling. We just saw a little creature jump out. So far, I have to say the graphics are really beautiful. Very slick, very clean. Come on, Abby. Show us what you're made of. Uh, what am I made of? Oh. So I can press, press to contract of objects. I need to. Okay. Try throw an object by holding while choosing the direction and a release to throw. So over here. Not bad. Well done, eh? Or do you think Abby's selling you short? I think so too. I'll get another. Can I get another ball, sir? I'll take it. <laughs> Here I am, just throwing balls. Okay. We have to remember that because we're a puppet, we have strings attached She's to us. She's not here by chance, though. No, this isn't a visit. This is her home. Fortune has deemed her artiste extraordinaire, though not extraordinary enough to command her fair share. Okay. Um. The ringmaster announces, Attention! The artiste, a meager little girl child, confronts the beast. Help! I'm afraid I've dropped my cap. Someone to the rescue! Can I be saved, my scout? Uh oh, we're in a bit of a pickle here. Oh, yes, this is our first puzzle. We can jump. I'm just gonna push. Just over. Maybe I can. Up oh, here we go. Here I am climbing. Can I swing? Can I swing myself over to another rope? No, guess not. Guess I'll climb myself up there. Can I... I can only go up and down. Up and down the rope. Let's take a look. Maybe I should probably head back down first. Like I said, this is my first puzzle. Okay, I'm gonna be... I'll climb up. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, guess not. Guess not happening. Help me, Abby. <laughs> Can I swing myself over to the teddy bear? Must I watch you being torn to pieces? I'd rather lend a hand if it so pleases. Sometimes life hangs on a thread. Hey, Abby, don't worry. I've got you. Okay, the narrator has got, got me, but... Like I said, the first, like right now, my first obstacle is getting past this bear. Yep, here we go. Well done! You've almost got it! Don't stop now, lose your wit. Hey, hey, hey. Can I grab something? I've thrown a 
morsel of your meat over there. There we go. We've got the we've got the hat. Abbey. Do tell. The ringmaster praises. You've mastered that well. But now the hours have wild away. That was the last performance of the day. Alas, when she's not before the cheering crowd, Abby's life is far from proud. You had the audience cheering for more. The ringmaster praises and then locks the door. Poor Abby, held in a small cage day and night, only free for the length of a staged fight. Food and lodging, if you eat like a bird, but oh, how she longs to see the world. What's this? A pair of rats take heed and bring an apple in her hour of need. Well, well. Looks like we are able to do something. Let's get the apple. Can't quite, can't quite do anything here. Oh. Okay, so right now I can't jump out of the cage. So what I'll do is I'll probably throw. Can I throw this? It's not working. Guess the rat will give us another apple. Thank you. And let's see. Let's see, we can throw something a little bit higher. Nope. Maybe not in this direction. Maybe hold on, let's see if we can hold we can throw it in this direction. Maybe I can throw it to the bear. Oh, here we go. The ringmaster storms in, disturbed it seems. What's going on here? He stomps and screams. Maybe we can piss off the ringmaster once again with throwing our apple at... Okay, let's see if we can throw this... Uh oh. No, wait. Hold it. Let's take a look. I think that's the only place we can throw an apple to. <laughs> He's just gonna come in and back again. Seems that's all gonna he's going to do. So while well, in the meantime we're just gonna wait for our rats to come back with just this one apple. Thank you. Let's see if we can do something in this area. Oh, here we go. Should she suffice with the bars of a cage? No. She belongs on the world's wide open stage. Impertinent? That means brash. Don't tell me you wouldn't make a dash for it. <laughs> okay, it looks like we at least we know what to do now. Alas, when she's not before the cheering crowd, Abby's life is far from proud. You had the audience cheering for more. The ringmaster praises and then locks the door. Poor Abby, held in a small cage day and night. Only free for the length of a staged fight. Food and lodging, if you eat like a bird. But, oh, how she longs to see the world. What's this? A pair of rats take heed and bring an apple in her hour of need. 
We're just gonna... Uh oh. <laughs> I need my apple back! Hey. We always keep forgetting on how to throw. Don't worry, we'll get there. We'll get there, everybody. Let me just throw it this direction. The ringmaster storms in, disturbed it seems. What's going on here? He stomps and screams. Should she suffice with the bars of her cage? No. She belongs on the world's wide open stage. Impertinent? That means brash. Don't tell me you wouldn't make a dash for it. Okay, we're just gonna wait. We just wait for him to leave. Now, here we go. And carefully, carefully, don't make a sound. She slips away from the ringmaster's grounds. Poor Oz. Abby knows too well how his captivity feels. Raging beast? Hardly. A trusted friend also wanting to flee. Abby, Abby, don't you see the threads holding you up also hold you back? Uh, Abby, didn't you hear me? Ay, 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 ay. Okay. Looks like we have another puzzle to solve. Let's see, can we grab anything here? Nope. Can I grab something? Nope. Hey Abby, my dear, my dear girl. Can we grab something? Okay, seems I can't do much. And um I Abby, can't your threads. Are you stupid? I'm not. <laughs> I swear I'm not, but Okay. Seems I can't do anything here. Let's take a look. Okay, let me push. What business does Abby have here? Boldly press forward or cower in fear. Okay, looks like the puzzle is over here and we need to find something, but right now I don't know what to find yet. Ah, it's no use. Can't go anywhere. Hmm. Can I... Let's see if I can... I can't seem to jump, but probably I need a lever. I don't need a lever. To get me down. This is gonna take a while, everyone. What's great so far is that the narrator is able to narrate and give us hints on what to do, in no sense, but at the same time, it's a little bit. Right now, I don't seem to have much to go on. Hmm. Can I push? Aha! 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 Can I? Without the help of friends, and those are very few, your dreams will stay dreams and never come true. Oh my! Goodness, thank you, Bear. Duh. Hopefully no one heard that. Uh-oh. Where do I go now? Okay, seems I can't. Seems I've got... Go in this direction? Probably not. The fact that the that Mr. Bear actually helped us. It's amazing. But now I can't go through here. Can 
I interact again? Nope, I guess not. Can I push this? Oh no wait, I can probably push it on the other from the other side. Push nope, not working. How about from this side? Push Push Oh Gather dear Abby, you can move mountain. Was it worth it? All this trouble? Us and Abby can continue their struggle. But what's that? <gasps> oh no! Found out! Fast! Oh no, Urs! Ah, the loyalty of a beast. So often attributed to the heart. But perhaps a deficiency of the intellect? Apparently Urs found Abby's cage to be smaller than his own. Well done, Urs. Though... Now she's alone. Quick now, Abby, run away. Don't look back. It's the start of a new day. No, Urs. Urs has helped us. Urs has helped us with our escape. <laughs> oh, it felt it felt a little bit sad for a moment. Abby wanted the world. And it shows itself at its best. The fields, the flowers. But you can't afford to rest. The voices pursuing her, they slowly subdue. To wind stroking grass, cricket orchestras, sounds all so new. Alright, it's... We're beginning of Act 2. Let's make a run for it. Jump the jump. Jump the jump. Can I fix this up? Can I pick this rock up? Nope, guess not. Let's make a run for it. Stone by stone, tree by tree. World without commands. It's strange to be free. The evening sky paints the air, coloring over Abby's despair. I got. I got an achievement. I got lunchtime. I can manage to sit down. Just interact with <laughs> the chair here. Ah, what a lovely sunset. And it's lunchtime. What a shame that I couldn't get Urs to join me. Okay, let's make a. Let's just keep going. Sunbeams tingling with warmth, inviting you. Continue forth. The world is beautiful, Abby. Look at its colors. Take it in while you can. Enjoy the wonders. It's just a windmill standing still, perhaps envying you for your free will. It is what it is, a stubborn wooden thing. Still, you can't get past it with your strings. Okay, here's another puzzle, so maybe... Right now, I'm guessing that it has something to do with um, getting getting the cow to move. Right, let's get the water going. Oopsie daisy. Okay, so there is like a timer to it. Look, Abby, that poor cow sure looks thirsty. Help the poor thing, give it a drink, then you can pause and give your problems a thing. Seems that it's not enough water. We'll continue. It's a little bit frustrating. Oh, here we go. That's the way. The mill waves Abby goodbye. Its arms swinging high in the sky. Can I get a butterfly? Can I, can I do something with these butterflies? Well, let's keep going. Hop, skip, 
Jump. Hop. Skip. Jump. Can I see... Can I do anything here? Not yet. Move on. I'm gonna need to jump across here. Some... No! Fall, my angel. I command the ground not to be painful. So I do have to. I have to actually make a jump for it. Jump! No, Abby! Crossing a line, leaping too far, it's human. I'm here to catch you when you've done something stupid. So it's nice that the narrator is able to catch us rather than having us to watch our lives. Little Abby stops with a shiver. If you want to be free, you'll have to cross the river. Okay, so this is a big river. We're gonna have to find a way to cross this river. Maybe we'll have to come back here and find some things, to, objects to interact with. Can't seem to find anything yet. So much for adventure. Second thoughts, little girl. Turn back. Your cage certainly misses its runaway. Oh, onward, Abby. Where's your spirit? Or have you got homesick so soon? Let's make another jump. Up. Oh, there we go. Can I? Can I interact with anything over here? Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, so we've, over here we get some. Oh, dearie me. Abby, Abby, charmingly naive. You can trip and fall, but not if you believe. Can I grab another plank? Nope. If worse comes to worse, you can count on me. Those strings on your hands are wings, you see. No! Abby, concentrate. Nobody's that dense. No, 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 no. Here, Abby. I'm here to help once again. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I can get any more planks. Probably not. No, my dear. Okay, here's another plank. So we're gonna walk a little bit here. Take another jump. So I can't right now I can't I can't really adjust where I'm throwing, so this is the only way I'm able to throw. Okay. Trying to find a, maybe the third plank. Most likely I won't be able to use that one. Can I find another plank here? Jump. I gonna find another plank of wood. I just want some wood. I'm moving and interacting as I'm I'm interacting as I move. Probably won't be able to find any more planks here, but we'll see. Guess not. Alright, let's make it back. Let's run back. 
far. So far, I'm actually enjoying this uh, little adventure game. Graphics are beautiful, the music is very pleasant to listen to. And what I also enjoy about this game so far is that there's the narrator who is there to give you some hints and tips in case something happens. Okay, probably. Oi! Ay, 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 ay. Not so rash, Abby. What will the audience think of you? Yep, here we go. Can I come across? Abby, I'm running out of rhymes here. Ah, okay. So what I will do? Yep, here we go. What's up? Resourceful little lass. Where there's no bridge, she uses her class. Uh oh, without tools, determination comes up empty. May I lend you a string? Lest fatigue be too tempting. See, you can trust me. You could have done that in the first place. <laughs> okay, moving on. Let's press forward. A hunter's cabin. A light. Looks inviting, eh, hey, Abby? Warm and bright. Oh, wouldn't that be fabulous? Can I go inside the hunting cabin? Okay, we seem to encounter somebody here. The old wolf is dying. Leave him in peace. His travels are over. Yours are yet to be. Okay. Flip. I'm gonna have to need... Need a drawbridge. Down, up, down, up, down, up. There we go. Here's the drawbridge. Oh, here we go. A girl who moves windmills will certainly manage to get a little card out of the way. Trying to grab hold of this hook here. Can I move this? Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this drawbridge and then. Move this here. Um, and I'm gonna try and see if I can push this off the river. <laughs> off into the river. Alright, here we go. Let's concentrate on getting across. Aha, here we go. And down you go. You're free to continue. Well done, Abby. <laughs> but I don't think the cart owner will be happy. Maybe I can. I should pet the wolf here. Can I? Can I do something with with this wolf? Nope, guess not. Anyway, yep, like I said, like the narrator said, the cart owners are probably going to be pretty bummed out that I trashed a cart. Okay, let's make a move on. Cool. Oh. You burn something the here. The trees block Abby with wooden claws, but. They're afraid they'll burn their paws. Nice one. Jump. 
Mud, thunder, and lightning are terrible opponents. Poor little Abby has to endure some trying moments. Alone in the world, she runs wildly about, while the embers of freedom are slowly doused out. Well, well, Abby, the world isn't all campfires and song, eh? Aye, it's a sorry state of affairs. Abby, Abby, you know you can't crawl under anything. Oh, very well, it catches your string. Okay, so we're gonna be, as you can see, I've been running and jumping. Ay 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 ay. Seems I probably need to. Ah, very clever. There we go. Now it's safe. I just threw the torch down. Pick it up. There we go. Take another run for it. Burn another tree. This torch is all you've got, Abby. I've heard tales of creatures in these woods. Dangerous vermin, up to no good. No! Well, at least I've got some fire burning in this stage. But make another run for it. Oops. Nope. I think I just saw a spider walk past. Make a run for it. Make a run for it. Okay, and just keep burning my trees. Ah! With her hideous legs, ready to devour you, catch you in her web. No! Foolishness and courage are next door neighbors. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, so the spider got us. What we'll do is, uh. Okay, so there's a spider here. There she is with a hideous leg, ready to devour you, catch you in her web. <laughs> Good. Fire seems to do the trick. Like your torture bit. Well done. You forced her retreat. But don't try your luck. I recommend you flee. Yes indeed, sir. That's what I'm doing. Exactly what I'm doing. We can add a run for it. Light the fire. Ay 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 ay. Okay. Looks like I can't. Hmm. Perhaps this tree can be of use. Maybe I shouldn't be running over with a torch. Yep. Okay, so I'm gonna need to solve the solve this little puzzle here with the tree. Because right now, if I turn, if I If I throw it upwards, it's not gonna. The, the tree is not gonna like it very much. But if 
I need to find some way to transport the fire over. Can I throw it that way? Okay, let's gonna make a run for it and grab it before the fire is out! Oh, just in time. Bait it. Trying to burn his dry tree again. It's raining. I know. Okay, so I'm probably gonna need to Can I well, you certainly seem to feel confident at the end of my strings. Uh, Manage to jump across. But I probably need to do something over here. I'm gonna another jump for it. Jump down. The fire's gone out. How are you going to light your torch now? Uh, it's probably. Okay, so far I need to find some way to get myself back up. You know how I wire acts from the circus, sure. Can I jump? Seems I was like stuck here. Okay, let's push, push. Right, I have a bit of a dilemma here. I'm like really, I'm stuck over here. I push myself further up. Oh, here we go. Alright, just gonna push myself slowly. Push this cart slowly. Upwards. Seems I need to consistently hit consistently hit the right and down buttons All right and just right now I'm just mashing the buttons here can I nope 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 I need to get myself through I need to get myself through can I get past this Bit of, a little bit of a frustration point, but we we'll continue. Wasn't built in a day. Oh yes, indeed, sir. Okay, I'm almost there. Almost, almost there. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to grab my torch. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna grab my torch and. Abby, do you see how much you need me? This is no place for you. Careful. Your torch, Abby. It's going out. I know. Okay. 
I've lit the torch. Nice. Okay. Okay, we've solved the drawbridge, the, the bridge mystery. This puzzle over here. Okay, and let's let's light this over here. All right. Maybe I should jump up. Do another tree burning puzzle. Are we mm. out of the storm yet? What you couldn't manage, someone else could do. Oh, the spider's dead. What have you gotten yourself into? Ay, 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 ay. I see something across over there. I don't know what it is. I'm just gonna bring bring the torch along with me. Oh. Uh oh. Should I? Hi, sir. Doesn't look trustworthy to me. Careful. Oh yeah, yeah. So we it seems that we've encountered the a mean person. Okay. Here we go. Tiptoe away, Abby. Quiet. <laughs> Whoever is able to slay a spider like that is possibly not the most compassionate. That was that was some adrenaline stuff there. Oh, we've got somebody with a moose head. Should we sneak that, past? That's a ring master. <gasps> All decked out in a dark forest. And conspiratively whispering with who? About what? Oh my, it's Tonda. The merciless plunderer. He's the one who tore the spider asunder. Abby's weight in gold shall be yours if you bring her back through my circus doors. Since she's gone, my world has gone black. Damn it, I want the little brat back. The ringmaster pleaded, the ringmaster whined, but Tonda just laughed and sipped his wine. Remember the bear? We caught him in a day without further ado. A little lost juggler girl won't cost but a few. Ringmaster, have your reward ready. We'll bring your Abbey back just as I told. Get ready, men. We'll be bathing in gold. Oh no! The <laughs> Ringmaster and everybody else is looking for me. <gasps> Poor Abby. Oh no, what are we gonna do, Abby? Well, the mercenaries and thieves gather round Tonda, as hungry and determined as a huge anaconda. Their leader is big enough for two, strong enough for five. They'll do anything for a buck and more to survive. Right, this is probably a sneak. And you can run. Let's get the timing right. You know, he's gonna go and. Ay, yeah, 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 no! Right, Abby, watch out for the light! No! <laughs> okay, time to tiptoe. Watch for the light. Gonna stand here for a little for a little while. Make a run for it. Uh 
Oh, there we go. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. We're gonna wait for him to row. And... Probably wait for him to come back. Yep, there we go. You ran right into his arms. Oh no! <laughs> sneak past. Alright, let's see how we can sneak past that guy. We've got... Probably need something to distract him. Okay, so I guess this is a saw. What I'm going to do is that I'm going to wait for this guard to move away first before before yanking the saw back and forth to drop it on the, on top of that guy's head. Okay, here we go. Let's make a little go back because he's coming back. This game requires just a little bit of patience. We have this log, this chunk of wood, roll out, roll on his head. Oh no 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 make a run for it! <laughs> that was a little bit nerve wracking. Wait for him to go back first. Okay. Okay. And roll it. Hey. Oh, that looked painful. Without some smart up in your crown, all the muscle in the world would only weigh you down. Just let them fight it out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, that was fun. All right, let's make another run for it. Once you sneak past certain death, it's easy to believe that life lies ahead. But Abby, you thought your luck had turned, but in fact, it's merely whimpered and squirmed. Oh, no. And now, only thickets too thick for a girl. So where is this oh-so-beautiful world? Dangers lurking in that swamp, Abby. Ay 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 ay. What am I gonna do? Help! Jump! Jump, Abby! Help! Can I push this down? Do you smell that, Abby? That's death. The world's perfect. And these gifts. Oh no! Tightening, Abby. Oh no! <laughs> oh, oh dearie me. Okay, so we've got a piece of meat there that we shouldn't be walking right into. Do you smell that, Abby? That's death. Okay. World's perfect. And, um... I'm going to have to... No, I can't... You've chosen. Seems like I can't jump into... Can't jump past that area. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to be... going to see and... See if I can push this. Smell okay. that, Abby? That's death. The world's perfect. Yeah. 
It's useless to battle a bog, Abby. Okay. You have to look at a thing if you want to see it. If you want to survive, you can't be screaming. Okay. Let's push this body. Seems that. Push that body in. There we go. There we go. All right. Make a run for it. Keep running, Abby. That's a massive thunderstorm. Another hop, skip, jump. Hop, skip, jump. Am I out of the woods yet? <gasps> no! No! Run for it! Run for it! No! 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 Ay ay ay! Oh no! Ay ay ay! Oh, that was that was nerve wracking. Okay, let's see if I'm just gonna. Thunder and his gang. Run, Abby! Run for your life! Let's see if I can make a run for it. You can't get away. Thunder calls through the woods. Watch out! Or have you grown so accustomed to me helping? Ay 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 ay. Abby's nowhere to be found. He's not used to having his prey escape the hunting ground. A moment of grace can have an exorbitant price. Abby's freedom is at the roll of the dice. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, we've got into Act 3. We've breezed through Acts 1 and 2 so far. Tonda's band of thieves has moved on, it seems, yet they continue to look, for this world is their regime. Once they've tasted blood, they'll discover your tracks. Rare is the victim that's managed to slip through the cracks. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this um, live, uh, this playthrough, let's play here for now. It's already been, since this has already been an hour. But so far it's been quite a fun game, even though half the time I feel like my my life is about to be in danger, running away from goons or getting trapped by spiders and all that. But so far it's been a really beautiful game. And uh, what I like about this game so far is the simplicity of it. Um, well, anyway, I, I can't wait to finish this and um, finish playing this. And if you enjoyed it, just uh, give me... Leave me some comments below in my channel. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching and uh, I'll see you next time.